hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel so today i am going to make this video for iitjm 2024 aspirants i hope this video will be helpful for all of you okay so let's start iit jam 2024 the first thing is that try to reach try to reach the center at least 30 minutes ago okay so why i am telling that please try to make a proper schedule and try to make a, try to reach the center at least 30 minutes ago okay uh, because as fast as you can if you go to the center you can understand the environment and everything okay because uh, there will be some checking or some other task will be there so i i thought that it is better to reach as fast as you can okay okay the two second in important thing is that understand the environment What I am talking that understand the environment meanings that uh, there will be many students who are giving mock tests in mobile phone or most of you are giving are going to give for the first time okay so going to give the exam the CBT based exam for the first time so understand the environment is completely different the the way you are giving mock test or the way uh, you are practicing during your preparation it is completely different so i think that it is better to understand the environment okay so if you reach uh, before the time and if you enter into your actual room where your computer is placed and you are going to give seat there and then you have to give the exam uh, so that si situation or that scenario if you can understand very well that that would be helpful for you okay so that's why I'm telling that understand the environment number three don't talk to others okay it is my completely my personal experience I can tell you that uh, IIT jam preparation is actually taken by maximum 2000 to 2500 students actually okay actually in the sense that they are well prepared they know the exams very well they know the syllabus very well they have read the things and they came here to get actual IIT but other students are just giving giving the paper they just attempt the paper okay so you can always find that some students besides you were always gossiping about that hey, have you covered these things have you covered that hey i have read that one i have read that this one so try to ignore them okay don't talk to others if they wants to talk with you don't talk to talk to others okay try to ignore them because uh, it somehow creates a problem in your mind okay that whether your uh, preparation is well or not okay because they might give tell something which you have not prepared okay but that is not an issue okay it is not the case that you have to know everything very well for the exam okay you have to do better the you have to do better ra rather than the other students okay that is very very important what i am going to talk okay what i am thinking because so this is the thing that uh, that usually the other students what they are doing they are talking to each others and they are trying to make a bad environment so that's why I am to I am suggesting you to not to talk with other persons okay okay the number four take a glass of water okay because it is important to take so you, you know everything that there is I have nothing to tell 
uh, about this one you may take or you may not take but i thought that is important so that's why i am i also took glass of water because sometimes a pressure is created in mind okay that somehow that uh, this is going to be my last day i prepared for a whole year so this that day will be very very challenging okay so mental pressure is something different so i i thought that uh, you should take a glass of water so that you can feeling comfortable okay okay and one important thing that i would like to say if you are feeling uncomfortable at any time if you were during the exam or before the exam if you are feeling uncomfortable definitely contact medical team okay contact medical team okay i know that these things they will um, always tell you but i want to make this video to tell you these things because then you can be prepared before i mean like before entering in the place okay you already know these things that would be better so that's why i'm telling you that if you are feeling un uncomfortable at any time during the exam or before the exam then definitely contact with medical team okay okay now now the important thing is that for the exam read instructions very well i tell you this thing because i know that almost all the years the instructions are same i know that but even if it happens every year that doesn't imply that that will be happen for this year also so instructions is very very important because there will be there they will mention all the notation they are used in the exam paper okay so read instructions very well what they are mentioned okay the notations the symbols they are used in the paper that will be that will be mentioned everywhere okay so instructions is very very important thing i request you to read instructions very well because that is not your part of exam that is part before you starting starting of the exam and before that okay before that they will give you enough time to read the instructions so please read not uh, not just uh, check out and uh, and submit that okay i have read that uh, you know that okay i know that you, you have read the other previous year question paper so you know but even if you, you you know that you should read it again because there might be something change okay so that's why i ask you to read instructions very well okay then you will start attempting paper okay when they are in the center they will ask you to keep okay one important thing the save answers okay save answers and if you were feeling that suppose you have cho chosen an answer and after sometimes you are feeling that that answer is wrong you have to change it so make sure that after changing it again you are saving that answer okay because that is very very important okay and one thing that i have uh, failed a problem that last year the thing is that scribble pad okay so i have to tell something about this because i don't know what will be this year rule okay because instructions rules are given to the uh, the institutes who are going to give your exam okay like the centers where you are going and giving the exam so instructions all type of instructions are given to them so we don't know but the last year problem is worse there will be scribble pad okay there will be mentioned iit jam 2024 everything and so they have lots of pages in that scribble pad but the thing is that if you need more scribble pad suppose they will give you one okay if you need more scribble pad then when you are going to take the second scribble pad you have to give back the first scribble pad okay that means you can always have exactly one scribble pad with you so suppose they will give you the first scribble pad you write down everything and your scribble pad is getting end then you have to give it back and and take a new scribble pad so my problem is that suppose you are feeling that i have done a calculation in the first scribble pad and after in final 
um, I want to check that whether there is any silly mistakes or something I need to check that then you you can't be able to check because you have to give it back that's why I want to tell you if your scribble pad is getting end then make sure that whatever calculation you did you don't require it anymore so that even you, you can give it back and take it take a new scribble pad okay because that is very important many students don't know this thing because last year this happens okay and this happens with me also because i, I thought that there will be some problem that will I, that i will check later but i can't even check that okay because of this thing because i don't know this rule that's why i want to tell you this thing or you can ask them that whether there is any instructions related to that or not okay this was the last year instruction i don't know what will be this year because uh, this completely depends on the uh, conducting institute it depends on iit madras what they are going to give the instructions to the center authority okay that the things okay now now i don't need to tell you anything so the thing is that it's almost uh, going to end so you can so now only two or two days are left okay so i thought that you may read something some short note or something like that now or you may not read that will not uh, create any issue but the thing is that try to prepare okay try to prepare your mind for exam so preparing your mind for exam it is very important thing that i am feeling so if you are well prepared okay i'm going to make this video for well prepared students who are actually going to give i am going to give an iit exam seriously okay so if you are preparing uh, for 6 months 7 months or 10 months or maybe one year okay you already know that what type of syllabus you have covered what type of questions you can solve you can't solve okay also you are giving lots of mock tests because i have already make a video for giving mock tests uh, before two months almost okay and requesting to to give the mock test very well so since you have already given you know what is your performance you know what is your level okay those who are getting good marks in your mock test okay i will request you all that whenever you are going to give the exam on the main day don't feel that i scored 60 65 at during every mock test i should score 60 65 now also see a, a batsman scored 100 on a day that doesn't imply that he will score again 100 100 on the next day so you what i am what i want to say that prepare your mind for the exam that i want to do well that's all there is no marking scheme there is no target that i have to do this and whatever i have told you that try to get first 25 that means the clearing the cutoffs then 30 then 40 then 50 in this way you have to do in this way range okay because step by step is very important from the starting you should not thought that okay i will score 60 that might not happen because the paper may be so so difficult so that 45 will be the will be the first i mean the first will get 45 or 50 because this happens the last year if you see the gate paper last year 2023 gate paper the air one gets 50 air one gets 50 that means it might be possible the paper will be very very hard maybe in that case 50 is the is the air one marks it might be happen or it might be happen the paper will be so so easy so 95 will be the will be the marks of the air one so it depends so you can't predict anything you can't predict anything so i will tell you that try to score step by step don't just start thinking that i will score 60 or like that i will score 40 or like that try to score one by one this is very important okay 
so it is a preparation of for your mind because i believe that pre i mean competitive exam is completely different you have read all these things now you don't need to read anything i thought if you stop reading that will not create any problem because and also if you study 24 hours for the two day that doesn't imply that you will get a good diet that doesn't imply it because because competitive exam is a thing that you have to prepare for a huge time okay so that's why i'm telling you that preparing your mind is very very important okay and the last thing that i want to mention the suppose you are starting attempting the paper okay you have started attempting the paper okay and see there will be 60 questions right you don't know what type of questions you are facing because it's rotated so uh, it's rotated like the question you are seeing that maybe the first question will be the ninth one of the other student okay that happened because it's a rotated question is there will be rotation is a computer based problem computer based exam even if you can't solve the first five problems don't lose hope why i'm telling because i know some students in the last year also they are well prepared they are good enough but they can't score well they can't get a good iit according to their potentiality because their potentiality was very high but they can't even get because of this reason that they they are feeling very pressured during the exam so try to reduce it's very very important because if you can't manage this that means the whole year preparation i mean there is no meaning of the pre preparing whole year because so that's why i'm telling you that these two days are very important for preparing your mind that even if you can't solve the five first five problems okay even if you can't solve the first five problems don't lose hope if you are feeling that you can't score in this section that skip and go to nat section because NAT, in the NAT section, there will be many computational problems you can easily solve. That you can easily solve. Okay. So, my suggestion is that whatever you can do, whatever strategy you can take. Okay. You are, say, you are taking, and there, there is no absolute way or ideal way of attempting paper. That you have to do NAT first, you have to do uh, some MCQ, then this, then that. That is not. So, the thing is that it completely depends on you. The way you are getting successful during the mock test you are scoring, I ask you to follow that way. Okay. But the important thing that even if you can't solve five pro first five problems, don't lose hope. Keep faith on yourself and move on. Okay. Because I I know that that will create a very very, I mean that will create a very very huge pressure on your mind. Okay. So that's why I am telling you that don't lose hope. Is very very important to prepare your mind. So whatever I have I have told you in this video, the most important part is the problem A that that preparing your mind. So only two days are left. I request you to prepare your mind because that is very important. Okay, and I hope you all will do good. Okay. So all the best for your exam and and really really it will be very good. It will be your day. Okay. Sunday will be your day. I believe that. Okay. Thank you.